Hey guys, Daniel Bates here with The Real Estate Tomato. And today I want to show you how you can add a Facebook fan box to your blog. And so I'm here on my Facebook page. Um, Facebook is really cracking down on members using their profile, uh, their individual profiles um, in a business way to promote their business and so we all need to go ahead and create pages uh, maybe you already have one maybe you haven't but it's time to do it if you're wanting to promote your business on Facebook uh, because they may even delete your account if they see you promoting um, your business so much on your uh, individual profile so here I'm at uh, here I am on Facebook I won't you know, go into the details of creating a page, but all I've done is added a, an image here and written a couple of posts. I'm going to go to this add fan box to your site here. It's going to take me right here and it's going to show you exactly what we're talking about um, displaying here. Uh, it's It's got, you know, your title. If you weren't logged in um, and a fan, then it would say add fan here. Um, and then it just displays a couple of your posts on your wall and shows your fans down here. So I'm going to go ahead and copy this JavaScript code here right click copy and I'm gonna um, go down here on my widget page grab a text widget and put it where I want it and then I'm gonna go ahead and paste for some of you that's all you'll need to do you can click save and that will be working if you're on the matrix however the matrix has a little bit higher security and it's gonna see this code um, as a security breach and gonna uh, it's actually gonna strip out some of the useful code and so what we need to do is you need to go and do a search either either follow this link or do a search on Google for Facebook fan box wiki and you should end up on this page and here they give you some useful code that's under the using an iframe instead of JavaScript section so I'm gonna go ahead and copy this oops missed one there we go copy all this code come back into my widget section I'm actually just gonna bump down this JavaScript and paste it up here so now I have the iframe and the JavaScript code what I need to do is copy a couple of pieces of the code in here so right where it says your page ID I need to come down here and copy where it says profile ID number from the JavaScript code gonna copy that and come back up here again paste over the your page ID um, same thing URL to your page gonna come down here copy the URL some of you might have gotten the uh, vanity plates if you have over a hundred members uh, or fans of your page uh, I've got two so I'm not quite there yet uh, scroll down copy my page name and just copy it over page name here once I've done that I'm really done with the JavaScript so I can go ahead and delete that and I'm gonna go ahead and click Save and we'll go take a look on my site and see how it looks um, but I have a feeling I'm gonna need to change a couple of things in here just to make sure that it looks proper on my site and I'll show you a couple of little secrets so that you can customize it a little bit more um, for your own personal um, likings so scroll down here the first thing I see is that it's way too wide um, next thing that I see is that I've only got two members and it's got space down here for 10 so I'm gonna go back to the widget section and again the width it's controlled pretty easily it says width I'm just gonna change from 300 I'm gonna change it to 190 for my page um, and then a couple of things to take note of um, is that it says connections equals and that's how many Facebook friends you you choosing to display so depending on the width or, or how many different columns you want you may want to display that differently I'm just gonna put three here and then stream is the what it's posting so if you change this one to a zero I'll just kinda show you what it looks like I'm gonna click save come back to my site and hit refresh but again you can customize this however you want um, you know you can put it uh, if you have a hundred friends you can make it show all a hundred friends if you want but this is really just a way to promote your Facebook page um, it's kind of another way to um, have members signed up so instead of your um, they, they might also subscribe to your RSS but this is just another way to do it so you can see here I've just got room for two and I took out that stream by changing that one to a zero if you have any more questions on this please feel free to email Molly at real estate tomato best of luck Daniel bye